Hello, this is Jay Foss back with a war video. Uh, we're facing Quantum Knights One Night Stand. Uh, this is part of the second farm phase, um, about five hours before halfway. And going in, mixing up my supports a little bit. They're going to be roughly the same duos and trios. Uh, but because of how hard it is to use Kara against teams with Panther, I'm bringing Kara here. I do have to be mindful of the villain's bonus. I don't usually like leading off with a team like this, but it does match the flanks. So here we go. All right. We got blue at the bottom. Can we consolidate it a bit? potentially get a diamond there's a chance of getting a blue to come up if not it sets up a yellow dragon okay we did get that crystallis will do attack down oh she doesn't do attack down oh it's one of those overtime things uh, i'm gonna go ahead and pop it to start getting to work. I don't want her firing twice. Unless well, she's gonna fire twice anyway. So that's a little bit unfortunate. Um, my ghosting would be up the middle probably with the yellow, uh, some potential on the left side. I'm not in a disaster yet, even though she's fired twice. <clears throat> so debating this side, Dark Lord will kill one of my heroes, so I think I'm going to start there. I'm wondering if I can... Do it this way. Swing mana cut, everyone. And minus mana generation, everyone. So we have some clears. Available. I'm going to take the yellow and see how it progresses. Need one more yellow for DeAndre, so we'll do this. I don't think El Nadaha will fire with that mana generation effect in play. All right, we got our heal up. We got Taunt up. We're going to go for big clears here. We want everyone to fire while Taunt is active. We'll go and set up this other off-color diamond to clear as well actually may not survive all three I'd prefer Horus to fire next well if Horus fires first then Kara will live and then El Nadaha's hit will finish off Kara and then Kara will have done her service valiantly Blue to finish this off Asterius and get a clear going. Nice yellow coming up. Go ahead and heal up. Uh, this is equivalent of two blue tiles with the mana gen. I think it'll get me there at least for Tenzel, maybe all three. Got an extra one anyway.
and hit one complete. Lining up hit number two. This is technically a farm team, but I do think this is a pretty solid defense. Um, Dispel and Fiend. Minus is okay. Just double checking all the effects because I haven't seen her a lot. I uh, wanted to bring two healers that went off at the same time. Here, basically, in case I get hit with a bunch of fiends, but it's a tough team. I kind of like this concept if the person doesn't have Miriam or Pipe uh, going in. Can set up one purple by moving a red. Going to make make it this way because there's a chance a purple at the lower left could arrive. Um, so I'll be stranding. A purple on the right, I do kind of like the... Making it vertically into the green to get a bigger clear, because that'll set up blue. And just, by the way, this, this pacing out, I'm going to need that heal, probably. So that gets it in position. So the blue into yellow into the purple, I like that move, and then I only need one more purple match. The extra blue was helpful. Okay. I have my purple. I will have the attack down. I'm trying to see if there's a way to manipulate. There is. Um, just do it this way. Maybe blue will come up. There's a purple. There's a blue. Don't fire, Anne. Don't. Okay. Woo. I probably could have lived Anne, but if Anne and Bass had fired, it would have been a, a bad day. We do have a revive. I'll go ahead and boost the health just in case. Hit two complete. All right, I'm back with hit three. Oh, I thought that was good got the wrong team up i'm back with it three if i sound a little bit tired i just got through shoveling snow i do have a water pipe team that one's a little bit more geared toward miriam That's not the right troop. And those are the troops I want going in. We have yellow, a decent amount of yellow. We can make the purple vertical for a chance to make a little diamond. If it doesn't, it'll at least give me a dragon. Making sure there's not better options. We can make the green horizontal. Consolidates yellow a bit. I think I like to go for the diamond. 
There's eight, assuming we can get it without water pipe firing. That blue actually is not... Okay, well, he didn't fire, so that's good. Uh, we'll play the yellow to get eight. It will play a green into the cat. Hopefully nothing extra. I think I'm going to do this side. Oh, the passive kicked in for a water pipe to drop damage to one. Let's set this across the middle then, see what we get. Okay, not bad. Um, I don't think Ojima's hit will kill anybody, so pop the yellow and end the match, hopefully. Good board, hit three, done. Hit four it is. I'm actually using my three, I have one magic and three mana red. I'm actually using my three mana here instead of the magic on offense. Okay, we have a green into Phalene that could, on the next move, to a yellow and to a purple and consolidate a little bit. Um, we have purple right up the middle. I actually like this. Well, I can get to green. Um, I kind of want to force fire Caitlyn before, or uh, force fire Phalene before Miriam, but I don't think that's going to happen after that little mana stop. Uh, we have a blue and purple that I like for clearing, but we can come back to that. Going to get the dodge going. We do have a red. I'm going to wait one turn for this heal. No heal. I will take the red this way because there's it's less stranding potential by that. I mean, more opportunity if I do it that way to up another red. So I need a dead move basically for the Toxicondra buff to kick in. I don't think this will chain into Miriam to set her off again. Um. I have more ghosting. Oh, they heal over time. I may have to go up the middle here. I will. I can't risk having Miriam live. The staggering turns of the specials gave an extra turn of healing, essentially. Um, let's kill Louie. We'll come back around and get the green tiles next turn. It may kill one, but it's unlikely. All right, cleanse and heal. Catelyn up. Clear with less tiles hitting the heroes.
Well, Eladaha is the bigger threat, but since I'm running red here, I'll do a la carte first. And hit four done. All right, Shea Foss back play number five. Um, I'm doing my hits in my basement. My dogs are playing. So if you hear something, it's either my Corgi or my Shiba Inu uh, causing a scene. But uh, it is getting closer to the end of war. So going in now. There's a ton of yellow. If I make the yellow diamond, it'll actually set up a purple diamond, so I'll do that. Because this is a nine tile, a nine tile, and a seven tile. I'm debating here. Let's do that first. I don't think I'll mess up the diamond. I was doing on the off chance Miriam wouldn't fire, but she's definitely going to fire now. <clears throat> I'd strongly prefer to save the diamond if possible, but I don't want to wait too long. Um, I also don't want Bastet to fire uh, before Panther fires. That would be bad. Um, my one chance at Purple would be making this red connection into the yellow diamond, which would send a bunch of tiles into Bassett. I think I'm just going to cast. I don't want to risk Bassett going off, but I also like this move. Oh, and the downside, the minions can send it back, which they did. So that was a mistake. Uh, we can probably... Well, that's actually a big mistake. Uh, we'll go here. And uh, there's only one minion. I'll do it this way. I want to make sure that this at least gets a la carte and has a chance at Quinnell. Now, I might get hit with everything. Might not get hit with Ojima, though. I'm do this baby heal. I'm going to send all the purple up in hopes that these three purple... My Corgi's eating an instruction manual. One sec. That's not yours. Might not be a bad time to pop. We'll go and pop. I will get the Bassets. Hopefully this doesn't kill more than one. A little bit of a misplay here. I think one turn left on this. I think I'm gonna play for the heal and wait. There's one slash attack. I don't think it'll kill any of my heroes. That combo could be... Alright, so we only have charge one. How many turns of dodge left do we have? We have one. Let's get the taunt safety net. Let's get the small heal. I actually don't really want anybody to fire here. I want a dead move. Panther. Grimble. It's a little bit of a misplay there at the start with the heroes not being timed correctly, allowing Miriam to send back a uh, buff block on my taunt hero, unfortunately. So, but should be able to be fine.
looking for purple or red. It's a relatively, I mean, it's never a safe clear when you're popping diamonds, but relatively safe clear there. To at least get the taunt. Hit five complete. All right, attempting the six of six here. You have a green into a red into a yellow that sets up a purple. We do not have, that's actually a big combo that is into a purple. Um, don't have a ton of green. There's gonna be some clears and there's gonna be some dangerous clears just with the uh, nature of the tank actually attacking. But I think this is the, uh, was a setup. Um, You can get a purple diamond. Um, I think that's my best play. Gotta be careful here. Um, let's take a pause. We have the... We have a seven tile green team. We have three. We have one move to get three more. I'm going to play this purple into a dragon, not a diamond. And that'll be three moves for green. The question is, will I be able to get around before anybody other than Tenzel fires once? And if I am able to, I think that'll be good. The question would also be, though, if I could take this diamond... Uh, then I could heal up, potentially. So it's kind of a... Because if I get no thought, I'll get the mana too. We'll do the heal. There's one green at the bottom. That was actually a very a nice combo to help out. I have ghosting on both sides. <clears throat> Um, we'll kill this side. I would like to get a purple for Basset Fires, but it's not necessarily required. All right, there's the purple. Put the thing up to prevent boss, give the Nullfod mana. We got a druid, uh, okay, so <laughs> if, if you're ever wondering when uh, uh, 2% will never matter on fast heroes, well, there's a good example. These are mana troops for all three, and uh, Grace has a 4% node, and Elendaha and Quinell have a 2% node, so there you go. I don't have any green magic troops. If I don't get a magic troop in the next, if I don't get a green one in the next magic portal, I'll do a Cyclops, because I do have a green Cyclops. Or Sticks, whatever you want to call. So 6 of 6, a nice bounce back. Um, lots of 6 of 6s, I would imagine, here. 6, 7, 8, 9, at least 9. 6 of 6s so far. 302 for me. 45 flags left at just under 6k, and they have 40 flags left at 5100. Um, thanks for watching.